Right now, a mother is pleading for witnesses to come forward with information about her son who was shot and killed while driving on a busy interstate. Investigators say 19 year old Uriah McCree was shot multiple times in his car during afternoon rush hour yesterday. This happened on I-85 South past exit 13 near the way station. WCNC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner is live outside Bessemer City Police Headquarters. Brandon, have police made any arrests in this, in this case? Well, Fred, police have not made any arrests in this case. They say it's still unclear the details that led up to this shooting, but Uriah McCree's mother says people are judging her son online, and she wants to set the record straight and encourage people to come forward with information. Christina Michaels says everything her son Uriah McCree learned, he learned from his mama. I told him that no matter how mean and ugly and cruel people were to him, just to be kind to him and that it would pay off. And he listened and he got him killed. She fears her son knew the person who shot him multiple times while he was driving along I-85 during Tuesday afternoon rush hour. All I could keep thinking about is when he was on that highway, he was probably so scared. I bet he was thinking in his head, Mama, they fixing to kill me. Social media feeds purported to belong to McCree show him holding a weapon before he was killed and sharing a post about getting shot. Police say it is still unclear what led up to the shooting. Michaels feels people are unfairly judging her son. He was loved. He had a wonderful family. He had a brother and sister who loved him very much. He had a son that he don't even get to go to his first birthday next month. He misses that. As she navigates what she describes as a nightmare, she's trying to find the strength to be there for Uriah's younger siblings and his son. No, baby. Mommy's just gonna be sad for a while, okay? I'm just gonna cry and be sad for a while. I'll get better one day, okay? I'm gonna pull it together, I promise. Bessemer City Police are asking anyone with information to call their detectives. Those numbers on the WCNC mobile app. Live in Bessemer City, Brandon Goldner, WCNC Charlotte.